What's up guys, it's Darkrai1998 and today I'm doing um, Pokemon Fusion. So this means I got to put one Pokemon and another Pokemon together and see what comes up. I haven't drawn all the Pokemon so I don't know how this is going to go. So I've got a little number randomizer on my phone. So, I go from 1 to 806, that seems how many there are, but I don't know. We'll look them up because I have the Pokemon Pokedex. I I know like the first generation from 125, but that's all I can remember. So, we're going to, this is my challenge. Every so often I'll do this number rating and then I'm going to do the drawing in speed so you don't have to watch all of it but you can always like see what happens like what's it going to look like at the end. So I've got the randomizer and we're going to find out which Pokemon is going to be which, going to be with who. So the rules are I can't do the same Pokemon again so if I was like use Pikachu and something else I can't use that same Pikachu again but for Raichu there's two um, forms the normal form and the Alolan form that, that that counts I can use both of those so if I use one uh, Raichu I can use the other one so that's the rules of my work so we're get, I'm going to do these. I found um, an app where I could put my. I can edit the films, I can sort them out. So that's what I'm excited about. So I can now do speed videos. So we're going to find out who is going to be the first lot because I'm really excited to do this. So we're going to do this first off. Oh, I didn't get a piece of paper sugar. Uh, I think I can remember. So I'll next time I'll make sure I'm a bit repaired, but I really wanted to do this. So yeah, so here goes. Our first Pokemon is two hundred and sixty five. So this should be in generation two hundred and six. You can look it up quicker than me probably. Oh, we have Wimple. Wimple is our first out form. So he's going to be our Pokemon we're going to use. And the next generation is 135. I don't think this is going to go well. And. <gasps> Jolteon. Eevee's electric evolution. So we have a bug and electric type to put together. This is going to be fun. <laughs> I didn't think I was going to do that but I'll have to see how this goes. Right, okay this was something I wasn't expecting. I was thinking something like um, Voltorb. I was actually planning to do a Voltorb. Probably next time I'll do Voltorb and choose a random Pokemon with this number rater. So yeah. So we got a Jolteon and a Wimpy who evolves into a Beautifly and all that. I wasn't expecting that to happen but this might be interesting so in a few minutes I am going to go straight into that and you will see me drawing which is going to be fun hopefully if I can I need to sort out my camera so um, for you it's going to be like a few seconds with me it might take half an hour trying to set this up so thank you for um, watching that part but here comes the next part thank you very much yeah. and I'm back with a uh, found out what point I can point my camera to now it took me probably five minutes just to get this in a good position like my hands there you can see my hand it's right there <laughs> I'm like trying to figure out but probably I should get a smaller book for this video but for now I'm just using my small one and look at the other please never mind that's not me they want anyway <laughs> anyway I am going to start and see if I can get a Jolteon 
uh, mixed with a wimple. So I'm going to do the Jolteon first and then I'm going to use the Jolt um the other one I keep forgetting this thing. So we start and yes I'm a left hander. <laughs> And um, right now you're going to ask me why have I only done like most of his body? Like I need to change the pace to get back to that Pokemon. Where is he? Uh, it's quite hard because it's on two pages. I might need to like get my phone out and just have the two Pokemon on it so I can find it easier. Uh, there he is. Oh well, now let's get back to doing him because you'll be asking me why have I done like half his body and yeah, you'll find out once I change his look which is going to be really funny which I'm going to do now which I know my cat I should put my camera on the opposite side next time but I just thought do on this over there so let's get on with it Right, I'm putting the pencil so I know where to stop when I'm speeding the videos. So I've, I've decided to do it like this because um, his body is like the main part and I don't want to like leave out the sm little face. I might put the smile a bit higher. But I'm going to put it in pen so that um, when I'm drawing you can see the outline of it. So I've got my pens which um, are called fine linen pens which give it a bit of a mark on it so my shoulder's starting to hurt because I got the camera on the wrong side the light on the wrong side and the book is well it's just a bit of shame it's all on the left side but they say left sides are a bit unusual they say <laughs> but let's get on with the next part of it which is giving it a bit of shape which I'm hoping would be working Uh, it seems my pen is um, Kadai, which is not the best thing, but I've done what I can for a second, which my pen, I don't know why, it's been doing that ever since, I might need to get some new pens, but I know what colours I might be doing him, because he's a bit of a mix right now, he's a red, yellow, orange... I can't even remember the shiny. If I can remember next time, I'll try and do a copy of this and win this shiny colour so that would look nice. So let's ca carry on with this because I am very, very slow right now. Sorry. And my pen is really not doing well so I am going to rub out as much as I can to save a bit of pen because I need that pen and um, I might need to get a new one so unless I get some other different one which is nicer so let's rub this out shall we and he doesn't look that bad which is quite good actually Though, make it a bit funny that Wimple has a new face. <laughs> I think the only difference from him is that he's got like a little bit of a um, cloak on his back. And then he got a f his new face. I made his eye a bit bigger so it like gives him a bit of a, a circle. Because in the Wimple's eye, it's round, not um, the diamond looking shape. Which I'm about to sneak for some reason. And where I am, it's starting to melt the snow. And, um, yeah, so if you can see here, I put some, like, little horns there. Um, yeah, I might as well cover them in for a bit while the pen's trying to dry up. Uh, luckily for me, there's not very much covering in, so 
and all my colours are like underneath the book. Yeah, yeah, I should put it upwards. Actually, this is nicer. And I'm going to start with a bit colouring in. So bear for a bit, which um, you'll see me colouring his back, which is going to start now. And there we go, we have now finished our, our new Pokemon, which I'm going to try and make a name for it. And if we think about it, I'm going to put the names up and we'll see what we're going to call it. Unless you guys want to name him for me. So, before my next video... See what we're going to name him and your name might be underneath him or on top of him. I think it would be better if your name's on top to prove it's you. Oh, bother, I forgot his nose. <laughs> the most important thing of all is his nose. There we go. Our new Pokemon, which is now electric and bug type because of what he is. I gave him the yellow spikes and then... I sort of went for a like a mix because he is electric and you can see that's like giving a bit more effect on his um back because if you think about Wimble he's a bit spiky from the look of it but then when you go to um Jolteon he's a bit smoother right here so I was like add a bit of spike there spike at the bottom so it sort of works from so yeah in my next video, I'm hoping we get a good chance. So this is part one. There will be more and hopefully we're going to go for a high level. This, I think, was simple. Though um, everything else wasn't simple, like the camera ring and the light. So next time it'll be on the opposite hand, the camera. So I'm hoping you all enjoyed my little guy. Which I'll turn this way, which is so cute. I think he's quite cute, to be honest. What do you guys think? Leave it down in comments to see what you think. And thank you for watching, and I'll see you soon. Bye!